you know, I personally, you know, think so. I think, um, you know, may not have been here before. You know, they know what it takes to win the Premiership title, even when teams are above them or whether teams are chasing them. They've got that experience uh, and they know how to deal with it. To see, you know, City, you know, buying the players that they're buying and having a go at it, because you know they'll be there again next year. Um, it's great to see, but I think, you know, you know, whether Manchester City beat Manchester United at home, I, I think it's all over, to be fair. Well, you, I mean, Manchester United have to play Everton, you know, which is never easy, but um, Ever Everton losing in the semi-finals to Liverpool in the FA Cup, might have, you know, edge might have dropped a bit, so you don't know how they're, in what mind, set their going to Old, to old Trafford. Um, but um, I, I, I just think when you look at the games, mate, you know what they got to the ones that City got. You know, we're all, we're all, we're all hoping that it goes down to that, mate, your City game. And uh, but I don't think it will, to be fair. Scalzi, you know, Manchester United, yes, because I think um, you know he can have his rests. You know, he's, he's 36, 37, 38 now, I think. Um, but going to England, you know, I think it's kind of. Sad, and that's not been disrespectful to, to Scalzi because he's a great player. Um, but if we're asking a 38 year old to come to, to England's rescue, then you know we must have problems. Uh, but you know, Carrick, yeah, Carrick's done well this year. I think he's last year he wasn't overly great, but this year he seemed to get more games, stepped up to the plate, and uh, put in some fantastic performances. And he, you know, I like Carrick, he's got two great feet. Um, he sees a pass, he can score a goal, so I definitely expect Carrick to go, that's for sure.